Good evening, YouTube. This is Green and My Tears coming to you on Green TV, also known as Katrina. So I'm going to be showing you some fabric I picked up at a yard sale this afternoon. Um, myself and Picture Love, we went to go get us something to eat. I went to go pick us up some pupusas, and that's a um, um, El Salvadorian. Di um, I'm gonna say like a popover, but it's extremely good. But neither here nor there. But on to the fabric. So. When I picked up this yard sale, the lady was selling each piece, but well, she was selling four pieces for a dollar. So I got at least 20 pieces, and I got to think that rounds out about six dollars. So some of the pieces, the first bunch I'm going to be showing you is a yard or less, and then the next bunch I will let you know what's a yard or more. So I don't know exactly how much a yard or more, how much each of them are, but I'm just going to show you just to show you the patterns that I picked up. And I like shopping at yard sales and thrift stores because you get some vintage fabric that you don't come across to um, with the current textiles they're manufacturing. So that's a good idea. If you're looking for something different and unique or something real dated and retro, try going to yard sales and also try going to so, um, different thrift stores. So on with it. So I got this piece of fabric. this and this is black with white polka dots I got this one and this is like a metallic gold and this is a metallic gold on red and that not this one too many this one now I am going to launder these pieces of fabric because that's what I do when I get fabric you I launder it if I'm not going to use it anytime soon I don't worry about laundering it because I I'm not going to use it anytime soon but these pieces I'm going to be using soon and I really like this one and my daughter picture me lovely really wants this fabric and it's retro. This is Michael Miller. I really like his fabrics. So isn't that cute? And this is a piece of blue fabric. Because I know in the video it might come out looking purple. But that's actually blue. And then this one. Too bad my niece is not going to be a, a cowgirl for Halloween. She wants to be a captain. So I have to make her a captain. She wants to be a captain of a boat. So I got to get that together so this is like some crate back satin so now on to the fabrics that are yard or more I really like this fabric it reminds me of the sky and this is a piece of purple and it's stretch and it looks like a velour on this side and looks matte on this side so this is a purple piece of fabric then we have this piece of green sheer fabric. See, I can see you through this fabric. So yes, it's green piece of sheer. And this piece of fabric. I like the splash effect it has on it. And this is a piece that my daughter really likes. It's a, like a floral print. print. And then also there was this roll of fabric. I don't know how much is on here. But this is what it looks, this is the stack of fabric. And so this is what it looks like, how wide it looks. So I don't know, I'm not going to unroll it right now to find out how much it is, however much it is it is. I was thinking about making, I can whip up a couple of placemats with this. And yeah. So um, that's what I got at the yard sale today. So like I said, when you're thinking about crafting or buying fabric, to make clothes or just, you know, crafting, period. You can, it's always a good thing to go to yard sales and also go to thrift st thrift stores. And also, if you go to a state, excuse me, a state sales, you also get good finds there. And so, um, also another place is if people know that you sew, like I know people that know that I sew. So when they have people that pass away or they, um, been get, they're getting they're up there in age and they're not doing a lot of sewing they want to give it to someone so they know where to get used so that's what i've been getting blessed with people that 
so used to sew to don't sew anymore they're giving me their fabric stash or so or some of the pieces that they want to get rid of for the time being so that's it for now um i pray that everybody's having a blessed day look forward to my next video for um the national sewing month and that is coming along well as to be expected and i'll tell you more in the video to come so um that's it for now don't forget to comment rate subscribe and know that god loves you peace out